knocking at the door. And we yeah. turn the page to the next calendar months, we increase our chance of seeing snow. So tonight we have meteorologist Reed Kissel back with some tips on helping you to prep your home for winter. Well, as we head closer towards November, we're going to start to see that increasing chance for snowfall. So it's time for homeowners to try to take advantage of the nicer weather while we still have it and try to winterize your home. There are many things that homeowners can do to prepare for winter. And since there are still leaves on the trees, you want to start with the gutters. The time is to get the leaves. Check your leaves in your gutters. Um, make sure the gutters are free and clear of the leaves. Uh, run a little late this year. The leaves aren't all, all down, but it looks like the snow's coming before they're down. So unfortunately, you're going to have to get up there and, uh, or hire somebody who's qualified to uh, get your leaves out of your gutters. Other things homeowners can do outside is take in the hose and cover the water spigot to help prevent pipes from bursting over the winter and into spring. You can cover the air conditioner, set your ceiling fan for winter, you can add insulation to the attic, and install weather stripping on exterior doors to help prevent any drafts. And for older windows... Oh, at older windows, a lot of people can't afford a new window. Um, the vinyl replacements are uh, more or less inexpensive to go with, but if they can't afford it, um, use the plastic that you use with a blow dryer. That really does work really well. Another good tip is to stake off your driveway now while the ground isn't quite frozen yet if you plan to hire someone to plow your driveway. In Deerfield, Reed Kisselback, News Channel 2.